Let's go. Come on. Yeah. Okay, today's video is with Adrian and we're doing a, I think we're doing a kettlebell workout in the park, but we have two special guests with us. <laughs> Molly and Sasha, so God knows how this is going to go. <laughs> but there's a dog park that we like right next, in the same park that we're going to. Yeah, so if we went, the day the dogs would probably feel guilty. Okay, right to the park. grips from Dragon Door and uh, they're a lot of fun. Definitely don't start on the concrete, um, but I've had these for about five years and I trained with the guy who introduced them to us. So the main thing is to use a lot of tension to kind of control where they are during your push-up. I haven't really warmed up as you can tell, but the cool thing about these, you can also do planks with them if you're working up to those first push-ups. There's also a bunch of other stuff too. Not on concrete, but I have been known to do burpees with them, which is a little bit insane. Yeah. <laughs> they look, they worry, look we tricky. With that. <laughs> there we go. Full body tension is the key with these, and don't start moving on them until you're ready. Like that. You got it? Looks good. Slow. Try to keep the ends of them flat down if you can. Pressing it up. Good job. Good save. And again, like okay, a, yeah, <laughs> if you want, um, that's a real thin yoga mat over there. And just that little bit of give will help you out a lot. Do you want me to grab that real quick? And just putting it underneath them. It's, it's weird because you have to like <laughs> keep it full on like square, don't you? Yep. That's the fun. Yeah. So just pop them on that. Like you don't have to be on it. Oh, that's the nastiest mat in the world, but they definitely need to be on it. All right, but you'll notice this is going to give you just a little bit of give to work with. A bit of grip. Just a little bit, yeah. Um, hardwood floor is like the oh, hardest. Better. Yeah, a little less nerve wracking. Yeah. But yeah, you see how much like you're able. It just has that just a little bit of grip, a little bit of give. There you go. Nice. That's good. Right. Isn't that fun? The other neat thing you can do. Is uh, if you want to, yeah, just, ooh, easy there. <laughs> uh, you can try mountain climbers with them too. Um, I also like to walk. The, I'll show you real quick. If yeah. you want. Now that we've got the mat out, I'm like, oh, I'll show you now. <laughs> do you want a quick go with that? Emily. Yeah, you can do them. Um, okay, we're going to give it a go. So definitely step into it one leg at a time. She hasn't been watching us. So. <laughs> All right, Maybe I just, yeah. Absolutely. And you know what? It's not that much easier. Yeah. So I'll show you how to like set up for the knees. So from here, I'm going to set them down and then one leg and then the other get into that straight, straight plank position. And you'll notice it's got a little bit more of a, um, of a uh, range of motion. So if you feel like you're going way, way down, you are. <laughs> yeah, that's right, what I was see. thinking. More yeah, chest, nice, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, nice chest focus, and you want to really get that plank feeling in the body. So one knee back and then the other, and yes, it's weird. 
If it feels weird, you're doing it right. There you go. Nice. Oh, nice. Excellent. Made that look easy. Yeah, that was all right. Very cool. Make sure to keep the shoulders down away from the ears. It <laughs> is weird, isn't it? <laughs> oh, so here's some of the other stuff you can do with these. So let's say, all right, so you knock those out pretty easily. Let's say you want to go to the next thing, but you're not quite really feeling the, uh, uh oh. Yep. Got it? Yeah. Not quite feeling the push up yet. So yeah. you can always get into a plank. And let me tell you, hanging out right here is no joke. <laughs> you know, you're just getting, getting really solid with it, feeling comfortable here. Um, the other thing you can do also is mountain climbers, which is, requires a good bit yeah. of whatnot. Um, plank jacks, which I'm a fan of. And then you can always do a few of our own favorites. Oh, I usually like to click them together at the top. I make a clinging noise. Neural there grip burpees. Oh my god. So, got some stuff to work on. <laughs> Lots of fun. <laughs> so. When you set, you set yeah. them down. So they're not like. Yeah, yeah. You want to just really kind of, and you can see we've marked do up you do, that. Do you do one thing, like, is there a way of... Um, the way you've got them there. Like is, that? Yeah, it's the most typical. Um, there's a, I mean, if you want to mix it up, it's it's interesting. Kind of like starts all over from the beginning. There you go. Pop them up, clink them. <laughs> That's the hard part. He's got a good placement. Oh, God. Jump it back. you got to have faith. Oh, got dear. It. Yes. Yes. Nice. Look at this. All one right. More, one more. more. You got it. You got it. You got it. Keep that plank. Stand up. Plank it. All right. <laughs> they are not fine. easy. No, they're not. Not easy. <laughs> and I played around with the neural grips. Neural grips. That's the right way to pronounce it, I think. Um, yeah, they were they were challenging they were hard on the um wrist stability so yeah i'll probably i might do a separate session uh with adrian at some point on on them but that's it day 16 mm -hmm. day 16 on the home stretch second half yeah so we keep going right mm -hmm. coffee sunday sunday afternoon and i need some coffee boom Thanks for watching. Oh, yeah. Thanks for watching. If you can like and subscribe, much appreciated. And um, yeah, until tomorrow, new week. New week? New week. I'm not sure what we've got planned tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Okay, right. We are out.